Hi. In this video I will show you a simple way to add bones to a 3D model. Using AccuRIG software to automatically add bones. I will use the model of the character Marin Kitagawa. Surface subdivision modifiers have already been applied. The model is still with all parts separated, body, hair, clothes. I will be selecting all the parts to export the model. I will be exporting to FBX format, but it can be of J2. Leave the export settings as I will. Then click export FBX. Now, with AccuRig open, let's start the process of automatically adding bones to the character. The software shows us that there will be 5 stages, and it supports a variety of standard poses. The program accepts both FBX and OBJ formats, as I mentioned before. In this case, I will be importing the FBX file exported before by Blender. As soon as the 3D model is imported, we already have the line that symmetrically divides the character. Now just click on the rig body button. Body bones will be automatically added during processing. We have the bones positioned automatically. If any bone has been misplaced, it can be manually repositioned. Once all the bones are right, we can jump to the next step by clicking the rig right hand button. After processing, the bones of the right hand will be added. We can position manually if necessary. We can move to the bones of the left hand on the rig left end button. Or the top button, left hand. Here we don't need to do anything else, as the adjustment made in the right hand has already been mirrored. Now just click on finalize character. The last step is to test the character. We can apply motions or pose offset.
We can also move arms and legs manually. Now just export to the format you want. To export, you will need to be logged into an account. It could be an actor core AccuRIG, Facebook, or Google account. First, we have three export options. In the FBX option, we have several other application options that we can export. This was yet another 3D character model rigging alternative, where bones can be added automatically and quickly. I hope this video was useful. Thank you for watching. Until the next video.